So it's um, it's able to control disease in like 80 up to 80 percent of patients. The problem is the other ones. Uh, you know, the 20 percent who, who um, are either intolerant to the drug or don't respond to the drug, um, and they need something else. And that's the group we focused on. Um, so what we did is uh, we got together. Um, an international group just talked to friends all over the world, 15 different centers in eight countries, collected cases with second line treatment, we call it second line, um, just to get, gather enough cases. Um, so, and all these uh, second line cases, they were treated mainly with two different drugs, tecrolimus and mycophenolate mofetil, MMF. Those who did respond to standard therapy but uh, had side effects, couldn't tolerate the drugs, uh, they also responded to the second line treatment. That's, that's assuring to know there is an alternative if you don't uh, tolerate the standard treatment. But those who didn't respond to standard treatment, between 50 and 80 percent responded to this second line treatment. And it seemed uh, like Checrolimus was a bit uh, superior to MMF. At least there were fewer Tacrolimus cases who um, uh, did not respond at all compared to the MMF. So uh, our main conclusions were that if you respond to standard therapy, uh, you will also respond to Tacrolimus and MMF. And uh, if you compare MMF and Tacrolimus as standard or second line treatment, Tacrolimus seems superior. It's not a big difference, but uh, it was both were tolerated well, and um, um, tacrolimus seemed to work a little bit better.